Ham case. Now we are learning that the Enforcement Directorate has questioned DB Natesh, who is a former commissioner of uh, Muda. And this happened on Tuesday. The questioning is in all likelihood going to continue to Zay as well. This is a money laundering case that uh, the Enforcement Directorate is looking at uh, as far as the Muda Commissioner is concerned and that's why the, qu uh, the questioning really is happening. It happened in Bengaluru where uh, DB Natesh was questioned in connection with the money laundering case in the Mysuru Urban Development Authority in which he has in fact booked Karnataka Chief Minister Siddharamaya, his family and others. Now that questioning is supposed to be continuing today as well. The federal agency has said that the premises of Natesh and other former Muda Commissioner GT Dinesh Kumar uh, on Monday as it covered seven to eight premises in Bengaluru and Mysuru uh, were also searched. These are fresh searches that are being conducted. My colleague Arunima has more details. Arunima, the fact that questioning is going to continue today as well, what was the line that you're learning of questioning that happened tomorrow and which way will it be headed today? Uh, so, you know, there are multiple documents that the Enforcement Directorate uh, is confronting these uh, Muda officials with. Um, the searches that were carried out on Saturday, if you recall, there were notices that were sent to six people associated with Muda. Subsequently, there were raids that were carried out at the premises of uh, builders who are uh, accused or who are suspects uh, in, in this entire Muda scam. And now this questioning that is happening of former commissioner essentially is to put together the entire chain of alleged conspiracy. Enforcement director suspects that the land allotment that was done to the current chief minister's wife uh, was not in sync with the law and uh, the money was round tipped. Uh, so there was laundering involved via these builders in which officials were also involved. So the documentary evidence, whatever the builders and their questioning has resulted in, that's what uh, the former Muda commissioner is being confronted with. Right. Also, the fact that uh, there will be uh, searches that will be conducted at various premises. Anything on any word on that? Also, Arunima, what are you learning about that? See, any investigating agency would not want to warn the suspect by hmm. disclosing in advance where they are going to carry out the searches. Hmm. So the ED is uh, tight-lipped, but they have been carrying out searches continu continuously and it's a process of continuous investigation. They're picking up evidence. Uh, after their rounds of questioning and then going ahead, get, get, getting uh, depending on the thread that they're getting, they're going ahead and raiding the other locations. Politically speaking, what everybody is waiting and watching is at what stage will the investigating team feel the need to question the chief minister's family? Hmm. Because that would give immediate fodder to the opposition to target him and demand his resignation with uh, you know more uh, earnestness.